Oh my gosh. It's a whale! It's Frankie Cheese Junkyard Datsun! Daddy, the mailman bought you something. Where did he bring me? Bring it down here. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh. Could those be the wheels for the Datsun? Yeah. What do you think's in those? What? What do you think's in there? Um, wheels. For what? For poopy pants. <laughs> What's this? Oh, it's the wheel! Oh. Oh. Call this one Walmart wheels. Here's a little I cat. I if Yeah, these will look pretty cool. Would you look at that? They actually sold wheels that fit on a Datsun at Walmart. Holy moly, and look how cheap. We'll oh. take us off to a quick test fit before I buy tires. Obviously, I want to make sure these wheels, the bolt pattern lines up and everything. Right, Genevieve? Is that a one inch spacer? Why don't you get serious around a six inch spacer? All right, let's take a look at this. Um, so, the stock Datsun has a four inch backspace off on these uh, 14 inch wheels. And uh, so the new wheels here, because I couldn't get the, the right offset, it's close, it's 4.5. So this wheel won't fit without a spacer because it's gonna rub the, um, you know, it won't rub in the back, but it's gonna rub in the front on the strut. Because I already know how close that strut is to the front wheel because when I run my big giant uh, R888s on the stock wheel, I have to use a 10 millimeter spacer. So, four inch back with back space with a wheel that it's the same. Um, this tire, on the new tire, the 16 inch tires are the same width as these tires. So therefore I know exactly how much space I need there. So using a one inch, one inch spacer, uh, you can see we're at uh, 4.5 inch back space on this. Even though it did, you know, the, it said it's a zero millimeter or a, a zero offset. Uh, if it was uh, these are eight inch wide so but i'm running a one inch spacer so that'll take us uh one full inch 3.5 3.5 definitely gives me enough room for running the the wider tires that i would need to run on this uh for the front and the back i don't have to worry about all right let's just uh, see if we can fit this now this was the one that has two different bolt patterns it's like one 113.3 versus 100 something like that so this is kind of a universal room uh, all right what happened here was I had like the wrong style lug nut that wouldn't quite fit in the rim holes I guess the lug nut holes uh, they were the right threads but they just wouldn't wouldn't fit so I had to actually get like a skinnier nut um, and so I just ran down to advanced auto parts I didn't want to wait a week and order like another set so uh, <laughs> hey, it happens, you know. Went down to Advanced Auto Parts, and they did actually have the lug nuts for these. Now, this is not dots in size. The wheels, the wheel adapters I got for these were had um, had the wrong uh, threads. There, it's a M12 1.50 on the um, adapter wheel adapters. So those aren't actually for Datsun. These are for the wheel adapters. Um, but as you can see, it's a different style. This is what I was trying to use that I had in the garage left over. And, you know, the the wrench, what do you call it? The socket wouldn't fit in the holes in the wheel. So these ones are made for spline drive wheel lock kit. And these are for specialty rims, which is what I got. And it comes with uh, the socket tool. And get some light in here. Uh, here be the wheel. Wait, I gotta do the, the right intro. Ready? One, two, three. <laughs> so, lug fits right in there. As you can see, there's plenty of room for a little specialty socket. And voila! That's what that'll look like. Like a I guess I eight bolt pattern. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna just do a tech quick test fit of this wheel now that I can get it secured. And then I'm going to take these wheels down to the tire shop and get some tires ordered. Just wanted to get an idea what we're looking at here. All right, looks like I'm using the right O's.
Yeah, let's go. Get these snugged up. <laughs> so, let me get the camera. Kind of see there. Move this box out of the way. So that wheel is sticking out pretty far. But not crazy, you know? See some of it. That's just the wheel itself. Once the tire gets on, it's going to stick out a little further. Uh, so we're going to have to get some fender flares on here. Uh, but I'm happy. It fits. Uh, with that being said, I know it'll clear the front and uh, we'll stick some low budget fender flares on here. But like I said, I'll get the tires first just to get the, the measurement. Um, but yeah, it looks, looks really good on the car. If I could pull back far enough. Um, we'll get the wheels in and see what happens. But actually first I gotta get the um, gearbox fixed. Before I can really get this damn thing on freaking ramps doing this shit. So, <laughs> anyways, I thought you'd like this update we got so far. So far, so good. Ooh. Stay tuned for part two where we get the tires mounted and throw them on the Datsun. Till then, please subscribe and hit like. Yay!